Hi Sagittarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for the month of December 2017. Generally, my readings are love readings, but I'm going to give you whatever comes up. I have pre-shuffled this deck for you, so I'm only going to shuffle it for a moment. But I do want to remind you that this may not resonate for you, okay? Because it's for hundreds of thousands of people. It's a general reading. If it doesn't re resonate, then it wasn't meant to be. I'm just going to make sure that that is zoomed in correctly. All right, so the basis of your reading is the Magician card. All right, that's beautiful. It tells me that a door is probably opening for you. All right, and maybe it's a door, to, a, a door that brings in some love. Okay, it looks like it is. It think, looks like things are heading in a more positive direction for you. You could have received some communication or you may be receiving some communication from somebody that is exactly what you've been wishing for. Okay, I do see that there's a new welling of emotion here. It looks good. It looks like change is on the horizon and love can be heading in your direction if you're single. You may not be single for much longer, okay? You may have somebody offering you um, some kind of emotional support, all right? It feels like your past insecurities are dissolving because you're receiving some positive attention from somebody. I think that your hard work has paid off. I think you're on a roll. I think you have made massive progress. I see friendship here. I see a celebration. It just looks like you have really mastered your emotions. And I know I've told you this before, but it's absolutely clear that you have. I think there's more of a divine connection. All right. I think many of you have decided to look at things from a new perspective and I know this has been going on for you for the past few months and I think because of that you're probably going to be receiving some loving care in the very near future. Okay, now time is fluid. This could be happening when you watch this reading. I'm recording it in November. It could be happening in December. This is a December reading. Or it could be happening shortly after, okay? Because time is fluid. It all depends on you, your situation, the other person's, you know, it, there's all kinds of factors. But it's around this time, okay? I do see the rods of love here. So many of you will be feeling loved, whereas in the past you weren't, okay? I feel like love is definitely coming in for you, all right? I feel like um, there could be a move of home. Some of you could be considering moving or your home could be changing. Somebody could be moving in, all right? I definitely see a commitment. There's a commitment here for many of you. And it looks very good. It looks secure and stable. It looks really, really good. It, I see togetherness. I think it's a month of happiness, of love, and togetherness. Either with somebody that you actually love or some, with your friends, okay? I just see a lot of um, happiness. <laughs> thank the Lord, right? Is that what you're saying? Oh, thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. But anyway, I see many of you had been resisting change. 
Okay, we have the hangman right here. You'd been resisting change, but I think this month you're not doing that anymore. You know, it's like, I'm ready. I see that you've been using your resources. You've been becoming more open. You have been letting things change. You're replacing fear with faith. You're replacing negative with positive. Your, your insecurities are fading. Okay, you've been nurturing yourself, Sagittarius, and because of that, a door is opening. That's the basis of your reading, and it is a door that leads to love, and you did it, all right? You put work into this transformation that you're going through, all right? You have. You're heading in the right direction, and you're heading there quickly. All right, things are happening very, very quickly this month. And I, I really think they're in regards to a commitment or a relationship or love. And it's all because you have changed your perspective. Okay? I think that your independence, your time of independence could be changing okay because we have independence here we have changing here we have love coming in we have a commitment here if you have not met somebody yet and you get invited to a gathering a holiday gathering a party anything go because there's a darn good chance you could meet them there okay definitely if it's a maybe it's a party in somebody's home or it's a work party all right just saying i feel like um it's going to happen very very quickly it's like all of a sudden love shows up and it just blows your mind okay i feel like you are going to be feeling very attractive this month and you will be attracting love so it looks beautiful this is for the month of december celebrate your success there is success here you have manifested this via your change from negative to positive you've manifested this new love or resurgence of a relationship you've done it I'm gonna start shuffling for the next poll I feel like your fear has dissolved. I feel like it's a no fear situation. You no longer fear the future. You are charging ahead. You are on the move and you are ready for this love. I think you have a newfound appreciation for somebody or for yourself. All right. You're no longer going to stay stuck in your current situation. And you've ma manifested the change. You have. You did it. Congratulations. I see that. You've um, started this transformation. All right. Seven of Pentacles twice. All right. The seeds were planted. You've been watering them. The time of fulfillment, the time of, um, you know, bearing your fruits are is here. It's been a long time. It's like you have been waiting forever for this new love connection to come in or this resurgence of a relationship you've been waiting and waiting and waiting and it seemed like it was never going to grow but it's here all right and it's exciting and it is going to shake up your independence all right it absolutely is i see that there could be love for many of you and whereas you were independent it could lead to a commitment all right, it could lead to commitment fairly quickly. It's going to be very exciting. This is an exciting new discovery right here. All right, this is like a dare. Do you dare to do this? Do you dare to accept this love? Now that you've manifested it, now that it's here, 
Oh my gosh, now what? I think many of you have gone through a major breakthrough. Some of it's a spiritual breakthrough. And now you're being offered this exciting new opportunity. And I think it's in love. But it's a little scary. Oh my gosh. If it has, remember, okay, I'm going to finish dealing. This is the lovers. If it hasn't happened yet. This is for the month of December. Now, I told you that time is fluid. This could be the beginning of January. It could be January. And it, the thing is, it might not be for you because you have to, if you have not, if you're watching this and you have not changed from negative to positive, then this probably isn't for you. Many of you that are watching this, this have already refocused your attention. Okay, you have already started your spiritual breakthrough. You've already released the negative you're thinking positive for many of you. And if you have, new love is coming in. And it is going to be very exciting. And it's unexpected. So this person, if it hasn't happened yet, is somebody that you don't expect. This is an unexpected um, choice in love. Where all of a sudden, this love shows up and it, it knocks you off your feet. Okay? And it shakes up your independence. It does. And it should definitely lead to a commitment. And it's going to change your focus completely. It's like there's a change of course. I hope that you, many of you, whoever is watching this, this, this resonates with, have. I hope that you really have let go of the negative so this door can open. I really do. I hope you really have changed your perspective so that this door can open, this new ex exciting opportunity of love can come in. Really. You must let go of the heavy burdens that you've been carrying. This heavy weight that you have been Carrying around with you on your shoulders, not letting go of. You must let it go so that the new door can open. It will not open until you let it go. And that's negativity. All right? You have to let go of negativity for this new unexpected love to come in. I have to tell you that this is not who you expect. Okay? So whoever you got in your head, oh, yes. You know, if you think this is a person, it's not. Because that's what this card is. It's when you think it's somebody. It's not. That's exactly what this card is. It's somebody. It's when you had your heart and soul set on somebody else. And then all of a sudden, somebody comes in and changes everything. That's what this card is. Okay. And it's a change, of course. It absolutely is a change of course for you. All right? There's a big door that is opening. These are both doorways. A new door is opening, Sagittarius. Congratulations. For the end of your year of 2017, that has been very much a living hell. And I'm sorry to say that, but I've been doing your readings. And I know that there's been a lot of depression and there's been a lot of despair and there's been a lot of, I don't feel like I've been loved. And there's been a lot of, nobody loves me, you know, or it feels like there's been a lot of deceit and there's been a lot of um, mistrust and abuse, it feels like, you know. So I think it's been a very, very rough year. But with the Magician and this Two of Wands, a new door is opening and it could lead to love or a resurgence of a relationship. The burdens are going away. And you're, you've done it. You have done it. You did the work mentally. A new door is opening in December. I'm going to get you an angel card. This is for Sagittarius, who has a new door opening in December because they've put a lot of work into themselves. 
and I think it could definitely do be have to do with love okay the ocean it's an angel card The ocean, the deep blue sea speaks to your soul, healing and soothing you. Even the act of imagining yourself dipping into its healing womb brings about desirable effects. Better yet, spend time physically near the ocean. Allow its power and beauty to wash away all cares and concerns. So Sagittarius, it looks like the month of December doors are opening for you. Okay. And I think they're doors, doorways to love, perhaps commitment. And you have done it. You have changed. You've mastered your emotions and released negative patterns and replaced them with positive. And I truly believe that love is coming in and it's coming fast in December. If it's not December, it could be November, it could be January. But this is a December 2017 reading. Okay? So, if you want to know more about Soul Source Tarot, you can check out my welcome video. Um... And I will be doing yearly readings for all the signs. I have a spread picked out. And um, it's going to be a yearly reading for all signs. I mean, it's for each one. You know, each sign is going to have their own reading. It's going to be a long one because it's going to be for 12 months. And anyway, I look forward to talking to you next week for the weekly reading.